I'm Nicole, this is the Midwest Teen Sex Show, and this week we're talking about... Asking someone out can be really scary. Don't let fear of rejection stop you. Practice rejecting yourself in the mirror to make it hurt less. I hear you like boobs. I got them. Let's hang out. So listen, I got this friend that really likes you. Oh yeah? You got a friend that really likes me, huh? Yeah, and my friend would really like to go out sometime. Well, tell your friend I'd really like to go out with them sometime. Oh, so maybe I'll give my friend your number? You should do that. All right, I will. See you at the roller rink later? You're totally in. I got his number. He wants to go out with you. He win. Tonight. The roller rink. You're going. Oh god, I'm so nervous. I should, I, I should wear something tight? Something tight, and he likes chartreuse. The truth is, it doesn't really matter how you ask someone out. If they like you, they'll say yes. And if they don't, they'll make fun of you. If you're shy, try chatting with people online. It'll help boost your confidence and improve your spelling. Despite what we adults tell you, not everyone online is some creepy old guy out to touch your goodies. Some are FBI agents. Tips for a successful first date. Do discuss common interests, do not talk about your ex, and take your date someplace nicer than your parents' basement. If your strict parents won't allow you to date, suggest they let you go on group dates to public places. If they still say no, ask how you can prove you're more responsible. If after all of this they still say no, do not threaten to kill yourself. No parent wants a kid who's a floozy and a liar. Hey Logan, you look really good. Um, I just gotta go upstairs and get my lip gloss. Why don't you sit down and talk to my dad? Dad, Logan, Logan, dad. Okay. So what are you and my daughter going to do tonight? I don't know, maybe go to my basement, maybe go to the movies, back in my basement, TJ Fridays, hang out in my basement. Listen, you little <laughs> If you even touch my daughter, I will cut off your Hang him on the mantle. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Got it. Ready to go. Be good. Okay, Danny. Oh, Bye. My ten. Love you. <laughs> At the end of the date, be honest if you don't want to see the person again. You may feel like a jerk for telling them, but you'll be more of a jerk when you avoid them, don't call, and start dating their best friend. Brittany here with another dealing with rejection tip. If you ask somebody out and they say no, just tell everybody at school the next day that they raped you. If you started dating someone as a result of this episode and you can't stand them, don't worry, we'll be doing a show on breakups soon, so hang in there. As usual, email me at nicole at midwestteensexshow.com and let's just be friends.